welcome back to the channel. It's Jason Matu here, your favorite person on YouTube ever. And we're in Palm Beach Gardens taking a look at a house with a design like I haven't seen before. This home features five bedrooms, six and a half bathrooms, just under 6,100 square feet, built in 2018, and it's asking $12,850,000. Now, before we get inside, I just wanna say thank you to Harm Meyer and Holly Meyer Lucas, the listing agents, for allowing us to do this tour. And on that note, let's bring up the driveway. So as you come up, you have herringbone design going all the way to the top, and then it opens up into this huge driveway. You can park multiple cars. Hosting is a joke, it's easy. You have a three bay garage. There's some toys behind there. We'll talk about when we get in there, but you're gonna have the three separate bays so you can pull one out at a time and then park the rest on the side. And before we walk up further, just over here, we actually have something that some people might appreciate. I know my mom is gonna appreciate it. We have a little herb garden back here, you know, chives, basil, mint, the essentials. Who needs Publix? You don't even need Publix. And then just next to it, you have a whole house generator. So your house during the storm, you got food and shelter. This is like the last of us when you were at that guy's compound, you know, you know what I mean? And so as we walk up, just the, the whole appeal of this house is incredible. There's balconies with glass railings. There's this beautiful covered entrance. And then another feature that's really impressive is from the garage. Let's say you park your car in there. You can actually walk from the garage straight to the home under a covered walkway. The steps going up just the same way you have them over here and then this is going to be our entrance to the home look how tall this door is compared to little old me and then as we open it it takes you inside a world of luxury so coming to your future home you have your little table where you put all your keys and glasses and everything right here when you walk in then you have this inside outside a boat just passed foyer area the water from your pool the water from the intercoastal this this whole entrance is just having that view and then so from this room you know it just gets bigger and taller and then into the living room it becomes two stories high and you have floor to ceiling glass windows you have this huge sectional where you can sit watch your favorite movie put on my youtube videos you're getting a crazy view of the water the boats passing every once in a while and if that wasn't impressive enough, just off of this room, you have one of my favorite rooms in the entire world. This is a wine room. So you come into here, you can hold, I don't know, Eric, thousand. You can put beers, you can put anything you want in here, keep it nice and chilled. Then you just grab it. Hey guys, you want another one? Jump over the back of the couch. Now you're watching Zombieland 2 and laughing all day long. It's amazing. And from this, we walk now. We're gonna pass the stairs for now and head straight to the kitchen. And the design in here, like I said, it's something that you haven't seen a lot of, which I'm in love with. Like for instance, the vent in the kitchen has a mirror on it. So it, it almost looks invisible because it's reflecting off the wall behind it. Everything is white and matches with the cabinetry. And then as we come around, the storage and cabinetry goes all the way down to where the table at the end is. But we have Gaggenau appliances, Mila appliances, fridge, and freezer hidden over there. Then you have some bar stool seats. This is perfect. You and the missus sit right here, have a breakfast and coffee together. It's like a Disney romantic scene. And then my favorite part of this whole space is that right here, you have these slide in doors. So you have a wet bar and it extends down to the other side. So this is the perfect entertaining piece. People have just had the most amazing meal of their life and now they're having a drink to settle their stomachs. And all of this with the atmosphere of the pool and the water in your view. From the formal dining room with the amazing light fixture and the view and the openness of this place, we're gonna have access to your pool, patio. You're gonna have access to everything here. So let's head outside and take a look. So right away, the whole design of this house is just super unique. You have this angle in the pool and the whole structure. So you just get, it just feels like art. And then you have a place where you could sit over here in front of a fireplace, get warmed up when it reaches the freezing temperatures of 70 degrees here in Florida. And then from here, you have your cabana bath on my left. And I want to take you inside because once you step in the design, the interesting design continues. You have these wood cabinets. I love the valve style handle on the faucet. 
and then through these doors you actually have an outdoor shower that you can access from the back you don't have to come through here but you have the same shower huge pipe very industrial with the same valve to turn it and this is all within the backyard of your incredible pool area so let's cut back so i can actually show you we're gonna have some fun so before we get down to my right on my left you have three loungers out here i love the black noodles and the black bowl this is like a pinterest thing waiting to happen and then check it out from here you can walk down across these steps and on my left this is just like a shallow area this is what you saw from the front door when you walked in and on my right you can step down into the pool if you wanted to and then up here this is just off the main suite some places to sit you can actually access straight to the down where we're going but i want to take you from that side down over here we have your simplistic that's the key word with this whole place simplistic outdoor summer's kitchen look your gaganau grill is hidden under here nice and simple sink some flowers the important stuff place to eat incredible view and then as we walk down a little further it takes us to the main open area this is an incredible place to just lay back relax have a cigar enjoy life and as we come down these steps you have a huge yard you know you have all this faux grass which is amazing because year round it's going to look like this you're never going to have a complaint no landscapers in your backyard just peace and privacy boats passing you in the distance it's got ocean access with no fixed bridges and it's 10 15 minute boat ride to all of your amenities within the area golfing clubs etc and so we'll come down this platform if about 100 feet of water frontage for your property and a lot of places to entertain i would put a bunch of chairs out here and have a party have a party if you will but on that note i want to face back the property let's head back inside we have to finish up the first floor we haven't even finished it up the bedrooms everything about this place is incredible you don't want to miss it subscribe like this video and i'll see you in a second head back inside down here on my right you have kind of like a closet you know mud room and then your downstairs laundry you have downstairs and upstairs just across the way over here this is where your garage is and you have one of my favorites in here it's like a sign i have to get one you have the tykan porsche fully electric it's gorgeous and it fits in here with ease so you have your charging ports if you have a tesla any electric vehicle it'll be fine right here and they have two extra spaces and you even have built-in cabinetry on the wall and i also should mention this is an ac garage so you can keep your cars nice and cool you get in on a hot floor today and you're not feeling it at all but from here let's head back inside and continue with the first floor Okay, so we're gonna cross back down to the other side. And on my left, you have guest bedroom number one. So like I said, the design of this place is something that I haven't seen before. When you come in, look at this. You have your shower backed up against your bed. There's no doors, there's no closed spaces. Everything is open and flowing. You have your walk-in closet on my right, and it's huge. You got tons of space, you know. And this is I, when I walked in, I thought this was the main suite, but down over here, you have the rest of your bathroom, the two sinks, the toilet. But this walk-in shower is the main focal point. The fact that you can just hop in, shower, 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 turn around, walk out, and then another really interesting feature. It's really, you know, European is that you have this soaking tub just next to the bed. It makes it feel like a vacation home. This is just like a house where you just have a lot of fun. And then you have access into your patio area where you can head down, go to the pool, go get a nice view, a nice tan. You have it all from this room. 
and we'll walk across back down. And even like the little accents of these windows, so you can see the water flowing as you walk. And something I want to point out about this door, Eric, look at this. The door opens both ways. So you don't have to, you know, just ergonomics, you know, head back in. Just across over here, we have the guest bathroom. This could be used for people who are in the entertaining spaces, just want to use the bathroom, very soft colors and then accent lighting, huge walk-in shower. And then on my left, we actually have an office. We have that door again, taking us in. This is like an office on the first floor. Great space, you know, guests needs to stay over, but you have the kids in all the rooms, great place for them to crash, TV on the wall. And then from this room, we're gonna head now upstairs to show you the upstairs guest bedrooms and the main suite. You don't wanna miss it. You have floating stairs leading up. There was art underneath the staircase. I don't know if you missed it. And then you had these floor to ceiling windows. This is what we saw from the front that created this really indoor outdoor feel. Also, I should mention it, the floors throughout, you have one meter by one meter Italian imported stone floors. And they feel really nice to keep everything nice and cool. Sitting area, loft, sit down, recline, enjoy the view of your pool, read a good book, look at, Bruce Springsteen right over here. So down onto my right, the guest bedroom number one from upstairs. So this is guest bedroom number two. You have it all. Same interesting design with the shower, the openness of the sink and everything. And then your bed sits right here. Closets on both sides. And then this room has its own balcony. You have everything you can want. Place to sit, view. Incredible for a balcony. Make our way down to the next guest bedroom. As soon as we come out, you can get a better look at the light fixtures from the entrance. Once again, like a piece of art, these string lights looking over the front of the house, down over to here. In front of me, you have your upstairs laundry. So you have upstairs and downstairs. And then before we get into the guest suite on my left, we have a balcony out here. Cool spot. We saw this from the entrance, a place where you can just sit down for the guests, really, they can have their own private outdoor space and it's huge, it goes all the way down to one side. Glass railings and the front is nice and quiet. The final guest suite is ahead of me. In this one, you have closer to a traditional design. Your shower is off to one side, still no doors, but I'm a big fan of that. You like this? I think this is cool. This is pretty crazy. You just walk right in, take a shower, the towel work, tons of space, and then your sink and mirror on one side. Your bed where you're sleeping every single night is facing the water and it's got its own private balcony. I don't know if you can see it. Got boats passing us. This is amazing. And so from here, that was the final guest suite. So there's only one thing left to see. That's the main suite. I have no words for it. Good thing we have cameras. The camera will do all the talking. Behind this huge door, it takes us into the main suite. Before we even get down to the suite on my left, this suite has a private office. You have a balcony, closet space, wet bar, drink cooler. You have everything further in the suite. It's the entire length. We have your walk-in closet on my right. Huge walk-in closet, private storage for everything, island in the center. But from out of this room, we're gonna make a right. And here it is. This is what it's all about, the main suite. Once again, you have that centerpiece walk-in shower in the center, dual sinks on my right. This is your bedroom. King-size bed, soaking tub in the corner again. Herman Miller chair waiting to be sat on. The wraparound views. You have views on my left, the pool and the water, and then you have access in front of me to the balcony on the main suite. stepping out this is uh privacy in a nutshell really you have your places to sit hang out views peace quiet boats passing this is like what florida living is all about right here 
And so from here, I just want to say thank you guys for coming on this tour with Eric and I. If you appreciated it, if you liked it, if you want to see more of it, hit the subscribe button and we'll bring more for you. And if you're a returning subscriber, I just want to say I love you, care about you, care about you more than any other YouTuber cares about their audience. That's a fact. And I hope to see you at the next one. I'll be looking for you. If you're not there, I'll be really sad. And a final note, go love thy brother and thy sister. Have a good day. Thank <laughs> you.